when you're able to have sex without ejaculating, you can still have orgasms and you never have the recover period that's required after having an ejaculation. Hey guys, I'm Jonathan White. I'm here to help you master your sexual energy so that you can magnetize your ideal life. If you want to learn more about sexual mastery, make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to stay notified of all of my new videos. I upload a new video every week and I also go live every Wednesday. It's a great chance to hang out with me and ask me questions as I talk about sexual mastery. So I want to talk about having sex without ejaculation. This may seem like a foreign concept for many men. You know, so many men associate ejaculation as being the the finale, you know, that the the closing act to sex, but it doesn't have to be that way. Why would you want to have sex without ejaculating? Well, there's a few different reasons. First of all, what happens after you ejaculate during sex? You typically lose your erection and most men are unable to continue sexually performing or they at least need to recover for some time. And when you look at the fact that the average man lasts about four to six minutes during sex, and then he ejaculates and is unable to continue, his partner is most likely not going to be pleased. So removing ejaculation from the sexual act allows you to last indefinitely. Therefore, you can bring yourself and your partner the highest pleasure. And a lot of men think that they're not gonna have any pleasure without ejaculating because they're so focused on this single point of ejaculation where you're literally discharging your life force out of your body. You know, it's about 10 to 15 seconds of intensity and then it's over, it's gone. Well you can still learn to have extended, expanded orgasms without ejaculation. And in fact, they are very superior to ejaculatory orgasms. But the thing is that because most men don't last very long typically, they've never felt the orgasmic aroused energy move into their entire body, which takes time, you know, just as a woman takes, you know, much more time to become aroused. If a man wants to get into full body states, it actually takes him a bit of time to, to really activate that sexual energy, bring it throughout the body and get into a full body state. It typically takes at least 20 minutes. So you need to be able to last that long to be able to get in a heightened orgasmic state. And once you've experienced these non ejaculatory orgasms, then you'll probably never want to go back to ejaculating when you have sex because they are very much superior. They can last much longer. You can feel them throughout your entire body. It's a much more it's a much more fulfilling experience, you know, in my opinion, because instead of discharging out your sexual energy, you know, most men, they build up the sexual charge and then they just release it in ejaculation. That energy is gone. Instead of that, you hold on to that energy. You cultivate it. You build it. You circulate it throughout your body, exchange it with your partner, and you get into these incredible, powerful orgasmic states. It's far superior than, you know, five minutes of sex ending with an ejaculation. Most men are sexually depleted. You know, they're ple depleted energetically because they constantly ejaculate. It takes so many resources for the body to create sperm constantly. And when you're ejaculating every day, you're running in depletion mode. And it's not apparent at a young age, but by the time you get into your your 30s or 40s or sometimes much earlier, depending how much you're spending your energy, then sexual issues start to rise. All of a sudden you can no longer get an erection or you have premature ejaculation. These are becoming very common sexual issues because men are depleting their sexual energy. And when you're depleted of energy, these dysfunctions will arise. To be able to perform sexually, you need to be at an optimal amount of energy. Sex is really Sexual vitality is a diagnosis of your overall health and being. If you're having inabilities sexually, then clearly something in your chemistry in your body is off and needs to be addressed. So your, your sex drive and your sexual vitality is a very good diagnosis of your overall health and balance in life. Now, there's a common belief that retaining semen for a long period of time, going without ejaculating, leads to increased sensitivity and very quick ejaculation, premature ejaculation. Now there's actually some truth to this. I talk about this in another video called No Fap and Premature Ejaculation. You can check that out. But basically you need to be able to have the skill to keep the sexual energy moving throughout your body as you're building it or else it just sits in your balls, becomes stagnant, and you do become very sensitive when you have sex and you will ejaculate quickly. But when you learn the skills, when you train in sexual kung fu, you can retain semen for long periods of time and be able to last indefinitely 
in the bedroom. So by having the skill to be able to completely control your ejaculation during sex, and if you choose to not ejaculate at all, have full body non-ejaculatory orgasm instead, you will have so much better sexual control. You'll be able to perform sexually. You know, what guy doesn't want to have complete control over his ejaculation? When you're able to control your aroused energy, it no longer drives you, you know, to, to seek that, that short-lived ejaculation. When you're able to control that impulse and move that aroused energy through your body, then you can be a master in the bedroom, basically. You can give your partner optimal pleasure, and you will also be able to give yourself optimal pleasure because you'll be able to last longer and longer and really build up these powerful, incredibly orgasmic states. So there are many benefits to being able to have sex without ejaculating and practicing semen retention, both for yourself and your partner. And the other common argument here is the issue of blue balls. So blue balls is a symptom that your energy is stagnant, it's congested, and this is resolved by opening the microcosmic orbit, which is the main energy channel in the body. I have a video where I show a basic microcosmic orbit practice, you can check that out. But when this channel is open, then you can circulate your sexual energy through it, so that as, as it becomes aroused and it's expanding, it doesn't congest in the genitals, it moves throughout the body. This is very important if you're going to be withholding your ejaculation during sex and practicing semen retention in general. So thank you for watching this video. Grab my free ejaculation control guide. It's in the video description, I'll give you some great tips on controlling your ejaculation during sex. And if you're interested in learning more about semen retention, watch my semen retention playlist. I talk about semen retention in many, many videos here on this YouTube channel. Please subscribe to my channel, like this video, and leave a comment below. What has been your experience with semen retention and withholding ejaculation during sex? I'd love to hear. Have a great day, my friends.